A project charter describes the work you intend to do by identifying the process to be optimized, the problem to address, and who is involved. The charter guides the project intent, clearly defining goals and the key people involved. For a quick win project, your charter includes the process name, process owner, process problem, if applicable, process purpose, and project team members. In this example, we'll create a charter for a project to decrease meeting planning time. You'll create the project title during the project builder section. The process name, which you'll also create during the project builder section, is the term typically used by your organization to identify the process you intend to improve. Use a simple, descriptive title if there's no generally accepted name. Next, identify the person who manages the process. They'll be your process owner. If there's no manager of the process, determine who approves changes. If there are multiple people involved, choose who is most involved. If you're unclear who to input as the process owner, simply list yourself for now. In the near future, you should identify and list the actual process owner. Consider if there are known problems within the process that you'd like to solve, such as extensive time or effort the process takes, or numerous errors with the process. If there are none, leave this field blank. Quick win projects may not have a specific problem to solve. During our current meeting process, meetings are not as productive as they should be, and often go over the allotted time. The process purpose describes the reason the process exists. In answering this, consider what the process delivers. The purpose of our meeting planning process is to gather input from presenters, schedule the meeting time and place, plan the agenda, and communicate meeting details to participants. You may be working on the process by yourself, or you could have others helping you. While you may be able to do this alone, more eyes looking at the process finds more opportunities. After you complete the project charter, discuss it with the process owner and your supervisor, who may request changes. You can update this summary as needed.